Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld. Just sitting here looking at Darth Alicia here. <laughs> She's really liking her uh, her power armor get up. Um, we've got... Well, I'm sitting here staring at this because through the night I let the game run for a little while since last episode, and and uh, Thomas Slav managed to... Actually, through the day. Yeah, we're at 1,800 hours. Um, so Thomas Slav managed to finish off our research on which one was it it's green it's here somewhere oh it's off the screen component assembly so that the table that creates more components we're back to ground penetrating scanner and then ship sensor cluster don't know if we're going to get into this we might we might send some of us off on a ship at the end don't know what the ends actually got planned haven't thought that far ahead, but we'll see if we can't find some more mineral deposits in the ground nearby with, with this. I've never had a chance to really play with this uh, technology, but we've got the ability to make components. And I think this room, which was going to be the new uh, research room, is going to end up being the new machining room. So the machine table will be down here and the component assembly table, and we'll pick... Oh, something else that seems appropriate to go into here, too. But let's get that one set up before we go any further. I want to make sure that that's going, because I've got Klaus right over there taking off to go and break down a couple of ship chunks so we can get our production component table up and going. Yeah, it looks good right about there, and that is going to require... It's only 14 components. I seem to remember 30 or 20 or 25. It was... Like if you're running out of components, you need components. You got to have an awful lot of components to make a table that makes components. It's kind of a catch-22, you know. We got to get that one going. And handy at the moment, you are working on that. Let's have you get started on this right away. Then we'll have David uh, pop in and, and uh, maybe finish it through the night. But that was the first thing to talk about. The second thing to talk about before I get the game going is that what's well, kind of a neat YouTube name? Uh, Fist and Antilles Flinks. That's that's quite the name. Um, wrote in, clear back at episode 30, still catching up on the series. And in fact, I've had quite a few of you guys, you know, come in late and just binge your way through the series and get here. He came up with a, I'm assuming he, Fist and Antilles Flinks, that seems like a he, uh, he kind of name. Um, found a wiki, Rim Wiki page talking about these chunks in here using them for cover using them for slow the you know the advantage of slowing down your enemies and it turns out that only the first chunk does any good it's as if they take a while to climb up onto a chunk but then they go the normal speed hop skipping and jumping over the chunks and then they take a while getting down off the chunk it might behoove us to take out every other one to make every other one a first chunk again in fact i was kind of playing with this before it got started and every one of our sections here are odd numbers we could actually make in every other one in every one of these sections and have it end properly beginning and end even in in here which seemed you know random pieces here we still have odd numbers in here so maybe after this episode if i think of it i'll go through and painstakingly i don't know no no i can't well okay i can but i won't be able to executed yet. I can go through and painstakingly put in, um, no, you can't do it that way, St uh, zones, stock dumping stockpile zones on every other space, leaving blank in between. I can't just delete every other one. I click right here and delete it. All the rest of it goes away. Oh, that's annoying. So I'll have to, uh, find a way to do that. Then the next time we go through a raid and the traps are all tripped, then I can trigger them all to, uh, um, where's an example right here to haul them away and get them all hauled real quick just dump them out into the field and then get it all reset we'll see if that makes a difference or maybe we'll just do like this section like I could do that now we could just bust open the wall there then take every other one out and then put the wall back together and then test it yeah we'll see so that's that's something that's that's worth experimenting with just so that uh you know, myself and you guys can see whether or not that's a tactic to, to try. Third thing, Kathra had brought up the idea of rabbits. I want to find... I know I've got one over here somewhere. Not a boom rat. You know how all the squirrels came in? I usually, whenever it rains, I go through and hunt boom rats. And I don't know if, I don't know if I've ever explained why. It's because when there is that event where wild animals all over the map come in and attack you, 
I suspect the game takes whatever breed out there has the largest numbers on the map. And I want to make sure that boom rats are never the largest number. That was quite the experience that I had years ago. That was early too, not long after uh, um, Rimworld came out of out of Kickstarter. I mean, I've got the game pretty early, but uh, boy, <laughs> that boom rat attack, whenever that mechanic came into the game, that's when I got it. Rabbit needs eats. They do eat kibble, and they eat vegetables. Okay, so Cathra was thinking that if we got rabbits instead of chickens or turkeys, maybe we could not quite go through the kibble so much. But it looks like the rabbits eat kibble too, as well as the chickens right here. Eats the vegetables and kibble. Same list, I think. I can't move. I would love to be able to put them side by side. I think it's the same list, so I don't know that it would make a difference. But... One issue that I got to looking at after the last episode, and it, since I have been playing the game a little bit in between to get caught up on things, it's gotten even worse. Look at the hay. We had nine or 10,000 sitting here at the end of, of autumn. We're at 2,000. Wow. Texas can't grow enough hay for this group, I tell you. <laughs> so... In between last episode and this, I went ahead and took down the oldest of the cows. And I took down four or five pigs, trying to lighten the load of animals. But we're still sitting on a lot of animals. So I probably need to go through and... Yeah, I... Hmm. Dogs were keeping, regardless. They're clean um, haulers. But maybe it's the pigs that have got to go. I'm trying to get more of the training going on so i'm eliminating a lot of the odd miscellaneous jobs so that sanger can just concentrate on the the getting uh, the ones that are ready and turning them into haulers and i hate to get rid of the rest but we really can't afford to feed them this one right here is slaughter and i might just have to go through and slaughter a bunch of these um boy i think so I really do. Let's keep our let's keep this group of haulers, and I don't know what their ages are. Uh, I've got it. Well, I'll, ch I'll check the very first one. Age seven, and does it say what their life expectancy is? Twelve. So we still got a lot of time left on that hauler. Okay. Um, yeah. Let's let's take out all the future munchers out of the pigs. It's still not going to be much. Boomalopes, we can't slaughter. <laughs> that would be Sangria's worst day. <laughs> Boom. Bull cow, calf, calf, calf. Hmm. Well, may as well get these guys up to cows. And then we'll go ahead and, and make meat out of them. The muffaloes. Boy, I would love to sell all of these things. I don't see us taking that many muffaloes on any trips anytime soon. Male, male, female, female. And... Yeah, three females, two males, got a calf, we got three calves down here. Let me know what you think about muffaloes, about thinning the herd over here and what we want to do. Alpacas, we've got three. We've got uh, three males over here. And what we want to do there too. I mean, the the wool is nice, it is, but it's not critical for us. We're just, we're just running out of supplies. Um, do the grazers have the ability to eat kibble? Although that's really going to kill us. That one is really going to be trouble. Yeah. So we've got that to deal with. So we have a few of them that they're going to slaughter. And that's just the way it's going to be. Um, last thing is an, an executive decision that I made after last episode. I'd made the comment last time that um, David had managed on an episode that I didn't record. I just grabbed a you know a menu and a uh, um, uh, an old save and went off into the world map. And experimented with caravans, so I had a clue what I was doing. And I uh, randomly, random chance while I was over there, a message popped up that uh, David had recruited Purple. And I got to thinking, that kind of proves that it's possible. So let's just go with it. Let's, let's get this bottleneck done, and let's get moving on. So I've decided to go ahead and recruit Purple through the dev tool just to get him into the colony, just to get one more guy on the list 
you know, into the game and get the, the process moving again. These guys don't have near the, uh, the difficulty in recruitment. Well, one of them did, but... Um, I think this is just the, the right thing to do here. Come on, there you go. So we've got a new character in the game. Purple is now going to be called... Fire over there, Bill. So Bill, congratulations, you're in the game with us. Who is Bill? Bill's 23 years old. And... That's all we know. <laughs> tribe, tribe child. So Bill's childhood backstory. Grew up in a tribe running around the village, moving with the buffalo herds, and learning essential skills from his parents. He never learned to read and never saw a machine that wasn't an ancient ruin. Shooting plus two, melee plus two, growing plus two, intellectual minus three. As an adult, became a warrior, fearsome warrior, proficient with many weapons. He participated in many battles. Shooting plus two, melee plus six, social plus minus two so great warrior both melee and really good at shooting not a preponderance of other skills but great passion in crafting which opens up quite a bit uh work crafting opens up tailoring and smithing as well so all three of these so bill you're near the top next to alicia which means we're definitely going to get eventually into crafting tailoring tailoring is that crafting? That's crafting. Art is not. That's something else, even though I, I wish art was on the other side of craft. It just seems that these three should be together. That always bugged me that that one was kind of stuck in the middle. Anyway, um, what I've decided to do, and, and Bill, you can let me know if you want to change that, but I thought about putting you on the night shift. So we've got a Bill, a warrior, on night shift. We've got David a builder, so construction on night shift, and he's also a good warden. Um, grandma, so cook and animal handler on night shift. Mississippi, miner on an escapee on night shift. Natalia, so good at different workbenches and a doctor on night shift. And then Sea Stars, who is good at construction and mining. So we get a fairly well rounded night shift now to, uh, uh, to keep, continue getting things done while the day shift is, is catching their Z's. So I think that's starting to round us out pretty good in, in skills. Now, one last little bit of homework before I get this thing rolling. That means that the next guys that are available on the list, we'll say one, two, three, four, five. The next five are Baldrick, Norman, Pavel, Gnarly, and Choctaw. So if you guys are still watching the series, let me know, because I have a feeling that we're going to get Decker or Klompster before too long. Maymay, I think, is going to come along pretty soon, too. Um, and so, Radar and um, Manuel, let me know if you want to continue the plan of being a, uh, a female character or if you want to hang on. Because if we don't get any responses from these five, I'm going to just con you know continue down the list. Next one would be uh, Oath and then Radar. And then it moves on down down from there. So, and Manuel, you're in there too. So let me know what you guys are thinking, who's still watching, and uh, what kind of plan from there. Otherwise, I think we can let this thing go. Well, that wasn't bad, 15 minutes into it. <laughs> my uh, my uh, summaries of, of what happened when you weren't here sometimes takes up a good chunk of the episode. That was quite a... Uh, little pause right there. I don't like those pauses. Hunter Lax, that is purple, or Bill. Okay, I gotta get Bill in my head now. Um, I set him for melee, so he's probably... What was that noise? Oh, Sangris probably slaughtering a wild boar. Yep, there's gonna be a lot of blood in our yard. Anyway, set him for melee. Oh, man! <laughs> Um, let me finish this sentence. Um, melee because of the 12. The idea that he's going to take up residence down in this area with others that are that are capable of, of melee, or, or at least are plan to be trained in that way. Sea Stars and David and Klaus is the warden. He's already in this area. I wish Klaus... Maybe we need to get Klaus a little 
Well, melee, he's at an eight, so he's he's one of the best ones. Okay, so but right now, Bill is the best melee in the uh, in the in the troop. So the the melee brute squad is going to be living down in this area. So that gets a plasteel mace on him at all times. So at a moment's notice, he can go you know thump on some escaping prisoners. Um, but he's capable of shooting. So we've got to think about that. And again, I'll voice what I did a few episodes ago. I wish that they could carry on their persons a primary weapon and a secondary weapon in their inventory. So I can put a pistol on Bill and he can go out there and shoot when he needs to and thump heads when he needs to. But it's not in the game at this point. Whether it will be in update 1.0, I don't know. But I hope it does. That just seems logical. Um... So at this point, Bill is going for, I assume, a shield belt, if we still have one. Yep, we do. The ones that look like bras. Yep, right there. But you're going for Duster at the moment, and then you'll probably run all the way back up here. But you're in the night shift, and your sleep is okay right now. Yep, so you're good for the, for the evening. Okay, with that handy. Oh, good. You are moving. Oh, the sound of slaughtering pigs or piglets. It's even worse. Andy, you are hauling steel. You get all the steel in here. There's 200 that we need. And then we got to come up with with uh, 14 components, which means I really need to watch Klaus. He's going to tackle the... He already did, the one that, that crash landed into us. And thankfully, this one is not that far away either. So, did I see nine? Nine components. Bonus. Normally, eight comes out of there. Um... As he comes out of this one. That one crash landed, so you know, recently. So maybe it's a little different from what had already been here on the uh, on the map. Although there was one or two others that have that have landed. There's nine there too. That's weird. Anyway, um, oh, pause. The whole point was Klaus, bring him in. Hauling by Eric. Um, we have quite a few projects that are just waiting for one component. So I've got to be real careful here that we don't suddenly get a demand for all of those components and there's nothing left to build the uh, the workbench with so you're gonna haul that in and there's a thump somewhere to get you to drop it off where where am I digging over here so right somewhere in this area while boar's pregnant so handy you need to drop okay that's grandma I'm looking at handy no that is not handy that is Klaus's path Handy needs you to go drop this off and then hang around while Klaus makes his trip in. Then we'll go figure out what's up with Grandma. So you drop that off. Oh, you're going to do all the conduit and everything but the table, aren't you? Well, it's nice that you did that, but still, now you got to go get more consuming pemmican. Hey, we have one good meal in there, too. How'd that happen? Um, at least one right. Oh, that's in the jail. Pemmican is up in here okay well handy wants you go for a regular meal for now and klaus where are you actually klaus you can stop right well, let's get out of all the pack of wild dogs there all right about there is good klaus you need to work on i can't do it faith you are sewing oh i can't do it because faith is in it now i can klaus you cannot work on any material component oh <sighs> Okay, um, drop it, and now you can, I have to get you to walk past, and then reset, there, now you can do it, there, great, grab those components, thank you, Eric, no, 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 you, I know you're wanting to take over that, actually, Eric, you can do it, you broken, broke down another battery, broken, replacing broken component and battery, so you want that component re... Oh, they're already over here. Oh, good. So, Klaus, drop that off. Thank you. Klaus, you're going to draft and undo, and you're going to go consume berries. Eric, you are now going to work on this. And now you're going to do it again? Nope. Good. You are going to grab the same things you were going to grab. That locks this in. Oh, the steel's already there. How did Handy bring all that steel and all this steel? That must have been another trip in there that I missed. But with that, we can get this thing built. And there should be no quality issues as far as needing the best builder to do it. Not that kind of thing. All right, so in that case, we got another battery that's out over here. And we do have a component or two roaming around. So we're going to get them all healed or all repaired. 
Good. So table's being built. Need a good chair. And we've got chairs available. Let's just do it that way. Um, chairs in here. I need to get a light in here so I can see this. So I need a superior. Normal. Normal. I want, I'm going to pause this. I don't want uh, uh, Eric to leave from there. Right there, superior. You are already planning to go somewhere. Okay. Where? Oh, i got to get some people hauling these things. Okay, got to get those in. In that case, you are normal. Normal. Um, here, poor. Maybe we don't have a spare superior chair. We do. We have two of them. They're already planned. Okay. Well, this wood right over here, and we know Eric can do it. Eric, where'd you go? There you are. So, but you're ending your shift soon, aren't you? 2,300 hours. Okay, in that case... Let's grab a... Any chairs over here? No. Nope. Um, there. Structure, furniture, chair. Turn you to there. And... Alright, so... Two things to deal with here. Let's go look at Grandma. Grandma just needs her social up. A lot of them do. I worked them pretty good, and they were already pretty worn out from the squirrels and from the hunt and everything else. So Grandma needs... You just need... Well, you're kind of getting there. You're very comfortable. You just what? What's it going to take to get you above there? You need to go do something you like to do, and you love cooking simple meals. And it's a little bit cleaner in here. Well, I could get you to clean that area first. Then out here doing the butchering. Miss B, you are making kibble. Okay, let's do all that and then shift have you clean this area and then go back to it now that we have components we can get a third butcher table going which is going to really help with the uh, the kibble production and i didn't get david to do that i want to go back and talk about something else david you're going to i'm right clicking and nothing's happening why david because it didn't completely grab david okay i need you to work on that i wish i'd looked to see what he was doing though that would have been nice. Um, in case it was important, Natalia is going to go... Re She's going to make an auto pistol with the last of our components. <laughs> That's what that thing has been waiting for. No, she made one. She made a good one. Oh, good. So, question. Do we, in fact, get... Or have, okay. Bill, do you want to be melee or do you want to be ranged? Because we could set you up with at least a you know, a good quality brand new auto pistol and get you out doing some target practicing soon. Or we can have you available to thump heads. That's the, what I thought would be the logical answer there. But if you'd love to go out and do some target practice too, let me know. Um, so you're doing that. So Hunter Lacks Weapon is what I'm leading up to. Work schedule, bill, and hunt right there. So I've got to take you off of that, which gets rid of that. Okay, um, Grandma just popped off of there too, so she is doing good over here. That's what it looks like. Okay, yep, that's working out well. Okay, Shantigo, you are two in the morning and you're up and ready to go. Okay, boom, and you're done. What was that all about? <laughs> he made one meal and said, heck with this, I'm going to go sit down. Um, needs, you don't truly need it. So when you're done, can you work on, uh, yep, that means to go and haul, and you can work on that one, or is it this one? I don't know, but something over here, two of these three need to be hauled in. That's fine. Our meals, we're asking for, it was 30? It was 25, and then I added 25, so it should be 50, right? Bill's 50. Okay. So, kibble is probably more important than anything. Actually, it probably is. Tell you what, let's not do that. Shantigo, let's clear all that and have you butcher. Thank you. Let's just keep the kibble going. And, yeah, butchering. There we go. Now we've got enough for kibble. Okay. Um, anyway, so my list is done. My list is done. Done. So now it's just playing the game. We've got a sloth over here. Mega sloth. Ooh. Mega meat. Mega fur. So I do wonder, while boars give him birth, 
I'm not going to go kill her baby. Uh-uh. We'll, we'll wait a couple days. Um, you need to be hauled in. Okay. So that needs to go in there. There's lots of little stuffs in here. I was, I, I was still wondering if when we take the animals away, that causes the game to want to replace them with something. And if that's what's going to trigger a herd to wander in versus having 10 gazillion little squirrels and rats and, and whatnot in here to uh, um, to give the map a sense that it's got too many animals already. Who is getting up first that's got the ability to hunt this guy? Um, we could use all of the, the non professional shooters we could digging up marble I did open this up we were starting to run out of space and I decided not to add this to this room but to tap right there and add this to this one if we got a a, um, a herd a migrating herd coming through right now we wouldn't be able to fit them all in here so need to do that but sea stars needs oh your melee yeah I can't do this that sloth will rip you apart okay Bill, you are melee now. Grandma, you have got a pistol. And you're dropping below your line again. Why is that? Training, because you're back to you're out to training, which means you're running through bloody areas and chunks and other things and and hmm. Let's try you out here. Let's have let's pick up a, a bunch of, of pistols and have you guys do a quick hunt for me. David, you are melee, melee, Alicia. You desperately need food and you're consuming pemmican. Are you really? You're not there yet. Okay. So let's... Where are you at? It would take you much longer to do that than... Yeah, we'll just... Okay, we'll do that. And we'll get the pemmican. It's only six, though. Hmm. I wonder how far six will go. I don't know. Draft. Go ahead and do that. And then pop out over here. And like that. Mississippi, you needs, oh, needs were there. Draft and pop out over here. And Michael has already got a good shooting skill. Natalia, great. Draft, pop out over here. You usually miss out on these, so let's get you out here. Sleeping, ah, you're fine. Draft, come on out here, Cathra. And Sangria's got a, Cathra and Sangria are, are where? Are they about the same? That's not what I wanted. Character. Sangria's at an 8. Cathra is at a 7. And Atali is at a 7. And we've got Missa P, who's at a 4. Alicia's at a 6. And Grandma's at a 5. Kaya is at an 8. She's pretty good. Faith doesn't shoot. And all of this crowd here does well. Um, yeah, well, no. I don't want the, I don't want the, uh, the assault rifle here. But Chantigo, you're a 10 with a revolver. Sure, why not? Needs? Yeah. So draft and come on out over here too. All right, we'll let this crowd happen and we'll wait for Alicia to get there. Sangria, you are... But well, we have the assault rifle. That's right, I didn't choose you. Okay. Um, animals, for at least a little while, we'll put the, the new wild boars over in the kibble zone okay and back while we're waiting have i missed anything in here sangria is going to be able to concentrate now on on getting her training jobs done but i don't see anything any issues there so let's work on training up these guys is that the right one that is hall okay oh we do have one right there and right there those just appear or did i just not see them like they're right there in front of my eyes there and there okay and this one that is a that one's going to go away soon and or is it that one actually yeah sorry that one's gone okay otherwise down in here i think we're okay alicia where you at you're on your way get okay. So you guys are right next to that 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 wild boar. How'd you guys come on over here? And Alicia, you too. Let's put a little distance between us and it in case it does go a little crazy on us, or or dances with that uh, that boomer out there. 
Otherwise, we've still got 10 seconds for Alicia to make her trip in. Not seeing any big prey that has just wandered in. Okay, so Alicia, Darth Alicia, that's what we're going to call her now. Um, Grandma's is saying, I'm not liking it out here. Uh-uh. All right, we ready? We are ready. Uh, Natalia, pop into there, just for fun. Now we're, now we're symmetrical. Go for it. Oh, revenge. Take him down. Take him down. Take a leg. We need a leg. There you go. All right. Woo. And break that. And who is the least skilled of all? Need our character. I'm thinking it was, there's a four in here somewhere. So Shantigo, Grandma, Grandma, five. Alicia, seven. Miss P, I think, was, and she, yep, 77 out of 6,000. She just made it to the, to the, uh, the five level. So, Miss P, you can finish hunting this one and get a few more points. The rest of you guys, go ahead and do what you need to do. Thank you very much. All right, so we got a little more meat coming in, and the pigs that have been slaughtered. Oh, there is one. Just uh, got brought in. Sea Stars is going to clean up the rest of this, and she's going to get lots of shooting skills over there. Shooting training. Okay, so we've got kibble in here now. We've got a a whole bunch of two eggs. Interesting graphic there um, for fertilized eggs. Oh, we're done. We need power. What's it going to take to get power? Handy, can you build me some power? Would appreciate that. Thank you very much. And we'll get this going. And probably get Natalia 9 in the morning. Probably not. Natalia is probably on her way to bed playing chess. Okay. So, who was the other one that was good at crafting? Or was that someone that we were hoping to recruit at one point? Um, crafting is... Natalia is an 11 at crafting. So, running through everybody. Eight. Kaya. So, she's been doing all of the sewing as a result of her skills, too. Um... So tailoring falls under crafting. And then we've got handy. Okay. So I I really, I think it's going to be Natalia at night. Because I need components being made like crazy. But I don't, uh, hmm. I want clothing in as well. We really need a lot. In fact, how are we doing on that? I was going to go grab someone to go up and get one more load of components for us. Um, why do we have so many t-shirts? We've got a bunch of Debbins clothes in here still. That's why. Okay, let's take that up to, oh, 12. Let's take this one up to pants 15. We'll go two beyond just to make sure there's plenty to swap things out. Another couple dusters and cowboy hats. Um, sure. And I don't, well, we'll make a couple of bowler hats just in case someone wants to to uh, show the, a little bit of flair of their personality and pop up with a cowboy hat, you know, like, like Darth Alicia here, <laughs> her personality. <laughs> um, so where am I right now? What is critical? Batteries are doing good. In fact, they're doing great. That one is going to get, in fact, they're doing really good. Let's turn you on and turn you off and pick somebody specifically to do that who handy you are or shoes hmm kaya Sip, feeling feeding simple meal to clomster um what do i want needs you're as good as say handy okay so you do what you're doing handy come over and do actually this one michael was going to but we'll let him continue what he was going to do and you can do that one okay so Andy you are not a power conduit you are building I think I want you up here you get the fastest construction speed and the fastest run speed come up and tear that thing down once and for all that's our last ship chunk that was our last uh, components in the bank let's put it that way there's a turtle that moved into the map so we are 10th of winter, essentially. Five more days and winter's done as a raccoon has moved in up there. And yes, keeping track of the animals is important now. We've got 
Lots of movement. Lots of rats are starting to take over. Hmm. Just thinking of how many times we got wild herds last winter in a row. Is there a chance we're going to get multiple uh, onslaughts of, of animals in a row this time? You know, a, a rat infestation all running through the gauntlet. Okay, so we are moving wool. We are bringing... We're down to 40. It just keeps happening. Okay, so with that happening, I need to assign somebody. Eric, Marble Tile, come on out and make this work. And let's get a third bench going. Michael, you are assigned to one. And if I were to right-click you here, Shantico's assigned to the other. And meals, we're at 50 meals. Okay, so it's starting to work now. We've got the meals taken care of. They're going to automatically drop in here without me assigning them. They're going to take over. It'd be nice to get a third one going. And we can get... Uh, a Missa P or, or Kaya, or not Kaya, but uh, there was someone else that just automatically dropped in. So we can just keep kibble going all the time. Kibble and butchering. So I think I'm going to not worry so much about that 26 kibble that's left. These guys should be doing it automatically now. And there's enough pigs and dogs that should all be distributing it. And by the end of the day, we should be pretty much back into the three or 400 range. Which is about what we're wiping out per night, is what it seems like plant has died. That's up in this area. That's going to keep doing that until we finally get this opened up and get these lights moved over and then we can you know, kill the uh, the edges of the fields like we've done over in here. So that won't happen anymore during the winter. Um, otherwise let's just kind of look around and see what's going on. Tomislav is researching, trying to get our ability to get deep mining going. Handy Got up there and back already. That's amazing. Go back there and get that, please. There's eight. That's what it, I expected the other ones to be like. Um, normally it's eight per ship. Maybe it's, it's a random chance of like seven to ten or something. Um, Rabbit, you are working in here. Great. Harvesting strawberries. They'll harvest first. Even though there's still a few spaces in here that could be sown, they'll go harvesting first. Uh, Shantico, you are making kibble. Great. Klaus, you are... Doing what? We have we have a Bill who claimed a room on his own. Okay, I was gonna say we need to get some folks moved around so we've got space for for our new recruits. Um, this is kind of where you're gonna end up anyway. Normally, I would say the newer characters get the nice bedroom last, but this isn't necessarily a nice bedroom, so it's not yet. All right, we'll just, that works. Let's just make that, let's just leave that as is. Okay, so that's there. But Klaus, oh, you only have two spaces left. Go for it. But then, Natalia's down here. Need to get somebody assigned to this one. Let's stop and think for a minute here. What is happening down in this area? Really, it's random, I guess. Melee over here, near the jail. Cooking over here. Doctor there. After that, I can't think of any real good rhyme or reason as to who goes where. So, I guess the next decider of who gets this bedroom, excellent bed, is which room do we want to start tearing down first? Which means, which, where do we want to add more power? Where do we want to add more gardening? Um, there was a little bit of rich soil right in here. Hmm. We could take out David's room. Now, David would be melee, so he would be down in this area, along with Eric. Eric is where right now? He's He's got the little the little closet over here. So Eric needs to be moved out soon. And down in this area, which means we need to start building in this area real quick. Um, let's flag this, zoom in a little. Well, let's just do it this way. Orders and haul things. Let's get this area cleared out, that cleared out, and... The rest of this room, there's nothing in there. Okay, that works. And eventually we're going to clear out the hallway so they're not running around in this, this you know, the, the junk piles over here. The dumping piles. Um, so I guess after this episode, I'll try to get in and lay out some more bedrooms in here like we did over here. And when Bill is up tonight, maybe I'll have um, a constructor. So probably Sea Stars get in here and start building 
the rest of this area so we're not waking up Bill in the process. Um, otherwise, Klaus, what to have you doing that would be helpful right now? Um, probably smoothing out this room. How'd this ever come out? We got a Warg Fur Armchair Superior that uh, Andy was working on. And we've got a Daylily in a good marble plant that Eric was working on. And otherwise, um, uh, Andy got in and got a lot of these other things done. And got this one done. Good. I'm looking for artwork, but I'm not seeing any. Excellent beds. Slightly impressive bedroom. 64. Uh, from that bed. Interesting. This will tell me. I see, because this one isn't smooth, so it's not even... It's room outdoors? Whoa. Indoors. Okay, explain to me what that means. Room outdoors. Oh, because it's not got this finished. How does that sound? That might be it. So, Klaus, when you are done, that is our next priority. Can you make this happen? Work on vent. Okay. Then we're at 1,500 hours. Um, Handy, you're doing what? You're hauling. So you're bringing in components. Boom, boom. Plants are dying. Okay. They're at the end of their, of their cycle of waiting for that sun lamp to reach them, which it never will. So Handy, when you've done that needs, you're fine right now food-wise. Let's get use your uh, your smoothing skills. Get you in here and do... Do the job that nobody wants to do. So you are going to hop right in here and smooth out at least half of this room. Maybe I can get Eric to do a couple of rows and Klaus to do a couple of rows and we can get this one done and assigned. Uh, don't really need to smooth that one. Strawberry plant died. Klaus made it in. So Handy, you can do four rows. And pause Klaus. That was really quick. Building a sterile tile. Uh, oh, one of the... You hit it up. Yep, yeah, you're going here. Oh, we got it done. Oh, good. We'll sterile tile that at night. But let's get Klaus to take over this area. No, let's go there directly. Thank you. Needs? You're good. You take over this group. Because you're nice and fast at it. And Eric, what you doing? You are doing sterile tiles. I'm going to leave you alone. Now, let's quickly set this up. Uh, refresh my memory. Kibble is um, any cooking skill, really. And we're doing 900. We're never really getting there. Drop on floor. And meat and vegetarian. And we're not using any hay. And we're still running out of hay at an alarming rate. So, in fact, I can probably go ahead and just get rid of this so we can get that hay moved over. Otherwise, this is going to be kibble first. Make kibble. Details. You are due until we have. Fastest way to get to 900 is something like that. And drop on floor. And that's good, that's good. Turn off the hay. Turn off the milk. Turn off the unfertilized eggs. You're just going to use meat and vegetarian. Okay. Yes. Okay. And then bills. I add uh, butcher creature and details. That one is going to be take to best stockpile, so we don't have meat sitting outside anymore. Otherwise, you're just going to do it forever. And I don't think I need to worry about any other changes in here. No. So you're done. Okay. So Eric's going to get this place all cleaned up. So. Theoretically, we lessen the chances of food poisoning. And Michael and Shantigo, nobody is forced to do this. Correct. Good. And that's just working like it should. Now, we've got mostly full batteries. We're running out of wood over here. I'm going to let it run out and see if by chance we get a good win tonight. And we just maintain it. I hate to be burning any supplies when we're maxing ourselves out and just wasting the electricity. So I don't want to go too much, but I have to make sure to not go too little. So it's kind of a balancing game until we get more power. But pause. This game goes by too quickly while I'm busy talking and explaining and just being noble rambler. Um, I need to move a person or two. Two of them, actually. But 
not melees. I mean, Eric is due for a new room, but it's over here. And David can move down, but it's over here. Sea stars, where are you at right now? You're up in this area, but you're melee. You're over there. So who is not melee? Alicia is not melee. Let's bring Alicia over to here and give her this room for now. I can't think of any reason why that's not the thing to do, but let me know what you think, because I'm not thinking right now. I'm just reacting. Where's Alicia? All right, go slower. You're not in that group. Above Eric. There you are. Assign. You're Alicia. And who else is... Did I ever get someone to do this last row? I did not. David, you up yet? You are. And you're building Sterile Tile up there with Eric. Um, 1,800 hours. Food. Let's have you turn back around. Grab a meal. Pop down here and do this last row. Yeah, something went terribly wrong there. Clear all that, do that again. I gotta read it a little bit better. You're gonna do this, and you're going to do. Now, what did I click? Oh, that one. Okay, don't build the, the couch or the, the chair. Just do that. Okay, so that should get this one done and ready for whom? Auto save. That always nails me right about this part of the episode. David and Faith. Faith could go down there. That would work. So Faith, your minor brick is Bill, who's having a, a bad first day. Um, that will be Faith, that bed. Owner, Faith is down in there, a sign. And Faith really needs her bonus statue with her of her scary blue hugs, dead hamster uh, hunting scene. Our superior beauty 100 reinstall for faith down right in the corner there and then what was this one over here that's left over by somebody else this one shoddy closeness by rabbit by michael um let's peek at that again what was this one surrounded by four failed experiments rabbit practices growing while grinning the image is bordered by six donkeys the style hmm this is only given a beauty of 10. let's go ahead and call that one done and we'll, well, well we can do so much better now but that gets a good room smooth room good quality furniture and a statue for faith so i need someone like an eric to well a faith f yeah let's see she's going to bed soon hmm she's getting her her tons of joy though because she enjoys doing the uh, the sewing okay well somebody needs to do that i don't know if i want to disturb her kaya what are you doing you're making a t-shirt that's important bill what's with you you are needs your joy is down and you're right back up in a good mood again okay so you're fine moderate amount of pain and lacks a bionic body part negative four that's going to be there the whole time so when you're done with that why don't you do me a favor and put that in and over here this is alicia who was staying break was staying here so this art uh Title 4 by Alicia, Beauty 75. Reinstall. You hit down into Alicia's new room, which is over in here, and you can pop into that corner. And I need someone to do that for me. We're now at 1,900 hours. Who's going to bed here real soon? David, Eric, Alicia, you're doing what right now? You're consuming berries. When you're done, you can move your own statue down. Right there? Yeah. Alicia? Nope, got to do it down here. Right there. Okay, Handy and David are almost done. Just in time for Faith to head to bed. And we got two more people moved in. So what have we got up here now? We have David up there, Kaya there, unowned and unowned. Okay, let's move Kaya to this room. Good bed and a normal bed. Um, can we pop a better bed in real quick before we get going? Before we commit to this? Just to... Nothing there. I did see one up in here, though, right? Or am I only thinking of these uh, bed rolls? No, there was one right there. You're a poor. Okay. Um, a bed took how much material? Can we get that built 
in time structure furniture bed hmm right there and switch you over to wood you take 35 wood that's all okay now let's do something real quick before we're at 20 hundred hours we got to do this quick um this one is the good yeah we're going to uninstall and hopefully be able to sell that at some point otherwise we're going to move kaya over to here so this is now a kaya bed um right there this is unknown this room can go away this is actually a good bed good bed oh normal oh actually it's the other way around good is better than normal okay so we'll make we'll make this one a kaya bed and david you can rebuild your own bed how does that sound so you are now a kaya bed right in scroll nope where are you at right there okay that's a kaya bed and you are no longer going to do that you are going to uninstall and david you are smoothing floors and you have eaten okay when no i need somebody else to uninstall this grandma what you doing you are training a bull okay <laughs> i'm gonna let you needs you're hmm grab that meal first so we don't start ticking down the uh uh, the negatives right off the bat training the bowl may take a while who up in here klaus is busy klaus can do it oh who's assigned for that one handy is let's have you do that one since you're here where's handy handy's down in this area and you're now hauling components to granite auto doors you're gonna go build something yep you let's use your skill for that who else can uninstall a stinking bed Natalia, I, I don't know if you can. Is that construction? I think that's construction. It is construction. I need to get that up before 2200 hours comes in. No, I don't. David is night shift. That We no longer have that, uh, that deadline on us. Okay. So you are heading in. You're going to just wink at it, and it's going to drop onto the floor. No, it took a little longer than I thought. Now, in fact, while you're... Oh, you don't haul. <laughs> Silly me. Okay, so you just go away. Um, bed. And right there. And David, you are hauling steel to improvise steel turret. When you're done with that, come on over and, and work on this. And get your bed built. And then, anybody else here? That thumbs down from Alicia. <laughs> Alicia. Darth Alicia here just slided Klaus. Um, who can haul that away for me? Um, you are busy working on this group over here. Okay, this one is off. That one is off. Okay, got another group over here. Haven't built that switch yet. Group over here. The beginnings of one over here. That one is in place. Mad animal. Where am I? 54 minutes. Jump to locate a mad turtle. Yeah. By the time he gets here, it's going to be next episode. <laughs> My priority right now is to get that bed built for David, but we're at 55 minutes. I'm going to go ahead and call this one done. And... Maybe I'll deal with the mad turtle in the night. Maybe we'll start when he finally arrives at the gauntlet. We'll see. But it's been a noble round. Oh, oh, look at that. Oz, you did it for me. Thank you very much. It's been a noble rambler. Catch you guys later. Bye-bye.